channel. I'm back today with another Alphalete haul. I've already opened my package. Um, but yeah, it's going to be a slightly smaller one today for everything that's launching. So, first things first, um, launch day to Saturday, March 18th at 12pm CST. Um, as always, I will insert the um, launch PDF here so you can see literally like all the items launching. And yeah, then I'm just going to run through my package with you guys. I've already opened my package. It is a slightly smaller one this month. Actually, all the pieces. But I have got a few bits and I thought I would just run through them anyway because, I don't know, you might want to see this. Wednesday today and obviously the launch is Saturday so I want to get it uploaded right away for you guys. First things first, we have got the Woman's Acute Bralette in Heather Grey. So these are sort of like little basics underwear sets. They remind me a little bit of like Calvin Klein back in the day. Um, as in, it's just sort of like a little bralette with an elastic band underneath which has the Alphalete branding on it. Um, it's a similar shape to six tops. Pop that on for you guys so you can sort of see. I quickly went and did a fake tan because I felt so pale and I was just like, this is just not a vibe. It is the Woman's Acute Bralette in Heather Grey. This is a size small. Um, I have pretty small boobs and yeah, this fits me fine. I wouldn't say it's super supportive. It's definitely like a low support. It's obviously made from like a cottony type fabric. So it's 46% cotton, 46% modon, 7% elastane. So, but it feels like cotton. It's just, you know, that kind of fabric. Um, this is sort of like the bra. It's got a little seam here. It is quite flattering. Like if we look at it, you know, I have very small boobs. Um, it has adjustable straps at the back. You, you can see that those are the adjustable straps. My favorite Alphalete product. I feel like it's not like their usual sort of like, I don't know. It's very comfortable. I always feel like cotton is super comfortable. I probably would just wear it for like chilling in at home. I've just, you know, popped this little Bolero shrug on. I will pop a link for the shrug. I got it in black and white in like a two pack. It's really poor quality, I have to say. Like, as you can see, it doesn't even fit the arm. It's very baggy, but there's loads of different ones on Amazon anyways. Yeah, I can't even recommend this one, but I'll put a link anyway in case you guys do want to have a look at it. Um, the next product is the Woman's Acute Thong in Heather Grey. So this is a matching thong to the bralette. I'm not going to put it on. I'm just going to sort of show you guys it. <laughs> um like this but you know you'll get the idea so as you can see it's got the Alphalete branding it is a very stretchy elastic and it is comfortable to be fair like you can't feel any seams or anything so yeah that is sort of the matching underwear set it's not obviously a g-string but it is you know quite a drastic thong is that a cheeky thong? I don't know. Put the thong on for you guys so I could let you know. And I can confirm it is a really comfortable thong. So the next item is the Woman's Acute Cami Bralette. And this is in the colour Vanilla. It's, so this one is more like the traditional sort of like furry kind of bra. I actually really like this one just because as you know me, I'm such a fan of neutrals and I feel like this goes really well with the last drop if you guys shop this amplifier drop. Like these shorts with this bralette in summer would just be really cute. So um, yeah, I'm going to pop this on for you guys. Again, it's got adjustable straps at the back. Oh yeah, they are. They do run smoothly. So I have just put on this bra and this one I actually prefer. Um, I feel like obviously you can see it's sort of like is a lot more supportive it holds my boobs in place a lot more i feel like i'd be more comfortable actually wearing this to the gym at least really do like this one again it has at the back they're really tiny straps which i like because often i feel like bras like this have quite chunky straps and yeah i have just popped this one on 
with the i believe this was the chai shorts um and yeah i feel like they go together so well they're so cute perfect for summer um and then again we've got the women's acute song in the color vanilla as well um so if we just you know imagine that i feel like that's a really cute set this color is just a bit of me i feel like i'd wear this all the time um so yeah then the next colorway is the woman's acute cami bralette in white now the white now i absolutely love this color as well um i wouldn't actually call this white to me this is cream i don't know it's sort of like a, a creamy kind of white like this is obviously a very yellow um basics neutral but this to me is cream and i think i actually i love both of them which one do you guys prefer i am curious okay so i've just put the white one on i would definitely say yeah it's definitely more like an ivory or a cream but i really do like it um considering that it's it's double layered by the way they're all double layered um but the fabric is really thin i would say it feels like a sort of single layered fabric but it is double layered there's no pads or anything be supportive and obviously i don't have a bra on so you can see you can can't really see too much showing through um so yeah i do feel like i would feel comfortable wearing this out in public without a bra or anything underneath guys like tightening the straps makes like a literal night and day difference so i've tightened this one pretty tight and this is literally so supportive i definitely prefer this style over the more bra shaped one just because i feel like for me it makes my boobs look a lot better it's a little bit more supportive and yeah i just prefer it but let me know which one you guys prefer also so moving on to the next item now we're done with the underwear we've got the men's collagate oversized tee in the color black i always order myself a couple of like t-shirts and whatnot just because um the alphalete tees are amazing quality like the fabric is just beautiful oh i love this one it's so like um okay it's a weird fabric so all their tees are very different this one is very good for hot weather i would say it's sort of like a cool feeling fabric like you know also not a fabric that creases very much um it's almost like got some elastic in it because it's very stretchy um and then on the back it has this really cool branding which i absolutely love again it's in like that nude color with black which i feel like is super cute i love like neutral and black um and yeah this is 94 percent cotton and six percent spandex which is really interesting um because that obviously gives it the the cool sort of fit it's defo great for summer i'm actually going on the most exciting trip of my life i hope so in two weeks i'm still waiting for my visa to be approved but i cannot wait um so yeah this is the tea oh it's very long i always forget to tell you guys what sizes i've got this is a medium i always size up in tees just because i like them to be hanging off of me but as you can see it comes down to my elbow um it covers it very much so covers my bum so you know this is perfect yeah. i'll show you guys the next item which is the unisex giant wolf head tee in the color clove this is also in a medium and this fabric is very very different to this one so this is very much like a sporty sort of fabric like i said it's got a lot of stretch like if you stretch it it sort of like bounces which i love this fabric but i also love a very old school retro fabric like the fabric like this one one of the things i love about alfleet is like how much detail they put into everything like how cool is that this is 100 percent cotton and it really does feel like 100 percent cotton um yeah so this is 
again i would say it is a cool fit it's not like a cozy soft fabric um but it's obviously like i don't even know how to describe it it's just like a pure cotton tea you know and it's more like a rough fabric me or this is more like a it looks almost shiny um so yeah and then it has the alphalete sort of like retro branding across the front little logo probably being washed with something maybe even like a slight acid wash but not a very strong one do you know what guys i've just shown you it the wrong way <laughs> the alphalete's on the back this is the front let me just put it on not quite my elbows the neck width so like the neck hole is a lot tighter so if you like something that like sits close to your neck then you'll prefer this one the other one has like a much wider sort of like neck what covers my bum but the other one i would say came down to about here i personally prefer the fit and fabric of the black tee but obviously you know it's entirely up to you guys what you prefer i told you guys the name so i'm just going to say it again this is the unisex giant wolf head tee in the color clove this must be the giant wolf head and then like i said the branding is on the back so yeah this one is it actually feels like a slightly warmer fit i would say the other one is like a cooler kind of fabric and yeah that's that um the final item that i've got to show you guys is the men's identity pro hoodie in black oh my god i'm so hot i don't know if i can put a hoodie on but anyways last item is the men's identity pro hoodie in black okay so this is a very different kind of fabric it's it's sort of like a brushed fabric very thin very it's not even lightweight it's pretty heavy but it's like a summer fabric it's definitely a cool fabric it's similar to the black tea the material composition is 95% cotton, 5% spandex. So again, it gives it that, it's not as elastic as the black tea, but it gives it like a tiny bit of bounce. Um, it's a medium again, this one. And I feel like maybe it's slightly more of a sporty kind of fit. See, um, first thing that I sort of noticed was that the width of the sleeve cuffs it's quite wide but it's actually like super comfortable and like a standard hoodie obviously has like a ribbed sleeve cuff meanwhile this is just like a smooth fabric and i actually really like that and it does you know how with jumpers like for a girl you really want it to like do that so you can have your bum out but you know you also have the option of being fully covered so when i pull it down it covers my bum but it, you can like pull it up to sort of it like that um these are the amplify shorts by the way so if you are new to alphalete you want to get yourself a pair of these i actually prefer the shorts to the leggings i don't think they'll have any stock in this color or if they have any at all but anyway i'm just rambling now so back to the jumper um yeah super thin definitely like a wide sort of fit it, it's a very different kind of fit so it has like a seam coming down here which opens up into like a middle pocket it does join um which i've actually never seen a hoodie that's cut like this a hood i actually really needed a black hoodie yeah i actually really needed a black hoodie and then it's sort of like yeah the hood i feel like a good hood is really hard to do Oh, okay. For those of us that live in the UK where it rains every single day, that's something we need. And I do approve of the hood. It comes nice and far forward. It's a really nice fit, this jumper. It's also like the way the fabric sort of like drapes. It gives it like a oversized kind of... There are a couple seams on the back coming down here. I really like this jumper. I feel like it's got very unique seams, obviously. And I feel like it sits just really nicely. And I do feel like it sits just like really nicely. Um, it's such a nice cool jumper. I feel like it's perfect for summer when you don't want like a super heavyweight one. And it's gonna be perfect for my trip because it, it's not gonna take up as much space in my suitcase. It's a medium men's identity pro hoodie in black. The branding is super subtle. It's on the front and it's just sort of like a rubber 
um, logo with Alphalete cut out. That's the tag, so just ignore that. But you can see the fabric quite well here, so it's sort of like brushed. Um, it doesn't look as like, I feel like my camera's just gone a bit weird. It looks very like matte. Yeah, this is a better representation of the colour. Really gorgeous, I definitely love this. But yeah, please do use my code GRACE. I will pop it throughout the video and yeah, I'll see you guys next time.